All right, so today we've got uh, set up for you another uh, drill point grinder with a web thinning attachment. This one is a Optima. Uh, they've been around for a long time. I'm not going to pretend uh, that I know a lot about uh, drill point grinding and web thinning, uh, but I will uh, go over what I know about this. This is the grinding wheel. Uh, you have a screen here. You put your tool, your tool holder through this uh, fixture and you actually bring the point of your drill up against this lens here and that's exactly the right uh, distance for focus so that you can see your drill point uh, after you've ground it. Uh, so you have a foot pedal here that normally would sit on the floor but for right now I'm going to leave it here that you press down so you can unlock this arm when, when it's not being pressed this arm is locked in the right position uh, to view your your tool and then when you want to go down to cut it you have to press on it again and rotate your tool in the right way to sharpen your two edges and then come back again and check it against a graft uh, there's actually pieces that would come in here you make those or you can get them from Optima that you line up uh, the edges of your drill point then you also have a mechanism over here it's a uh, drill splitting attachment. You've got to turn this on. It's got a little grinding wheel. This will only run when the, this fixture is moved all the way over to the right hand position and somehow this uh, little stone wheel comes down and does an operation called uh, web splitting. I'm going to cut that off for now. Again you got to press on this and then this can be set you got stops here so that you can move this in a certain way when you're in front of your wheel. And this is all adjustable here, here. All this stuff is adjustable. And uh, I'll turn this off for a second. And here we've got a couple of extra, actually several, uh, wheel hubs. Some are diamond wheels, some are stone wheels. Uh, I got some extra light bulbs. And these are your tool holding fixtures. This, this type of tool holder is basically a, a three-jaw or four-jaw chuck. And you put your drill in there, and you come up through here, and uh, you rotate the whole thing. It's got pushes this. You can push this in. Oh, I can't do it right now. This gets pushed in, and you rotate it. So you got two different size drill collets uh, that will be listed in the quotation uh, drill chucks. But this is the larger of the two, and there's one that's slightly uh, for smaller size drills. And these will hold cover all your fraction and number drills and letter drills. Then you have um, a collet attachment. The machine comes with a bunch of collets. I'm going to try to write these up for you. These are the uh, Optima collets. These are all precision collets. They drop in through the back of this. Uh, you, put, you would put your drill in here first. You have a special sleeve that goes behind it, goes down through here. You put your drill, that'll, that collet is made just to hold one size drill and just cl clamp it a little bit to hold it tight and then you tighten it up from the back and you use that. So you've got this, all these different collets here for that purpose. And again, we're going to write all these up so you know what they are. They'll be listed on our website. In the next drawer, we've got some more stone wheels and some more collets. Now, this is a different type of collet. I'm not 100% sure, but I believe it goes in the front here to hold uh, different sizes that go even bigger than that other accessory could go, that other collet holder could go. Um, so that's it. That's the uh, Optima drill grinder. Um, it's a nice condition. This cabinet goes with it. There's nothing in the bottom here. And that's it. It's 110 volts. Just plug it in the wall and you're good to go. Thank you.